foolish mortals. Confusion! Yeah. He even took the A out of the name. Tent Cruel. Tent Cruel. Uh oh. <laughs> you should have killed me while you had the chance. Splat. <laughs> Tentacle is another one of those cool ass Pokemon, cool ass Gen 1 Pokemon. Did you ever watch the anime? Like, like the first season anime? Yeah, way back in the you day. Couple? Do you remember the episode where there nope. was a giant ass Tentacruel attacking the city? You don't remember that shit? I remember seeing pictures of Ash telling Pikachu to deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> Solve this. Yeah, what the fuck you want me to do? I'm like two feet tall. <laughs> I love that shit. Where's that fucking Pacific Rim movie? <laughs> right. I wish I could see Samurai Jack stuck in the Pokemon world. Why? I don't know. Why does Pokemon get cut up with a sword? Cut up all these Pokemon. That's kind of fucked up to think about. Like, if most of these Pokemon existed in Samurai Jack as enemies, he would have no problem slicing them apart. Because mm -mm. those are the rules in Samurai Jack. You can, you can kill it as long as it is an alien or a robot. Yeah. Or it doesn't speak, or... I think it's gotta be yeah. Bugger Robot. You can't, like... Like, if it can talk, you're not allowed to kill it. Uh. Kinda like regular society. <laughs> oh! How? You know... <laughs> I choose not to question something. It just does that really awkward thing where it's, like, slamming its head into the ground. Oh, damn it! Oh, God, that's so jarring. Yeah, it's, like, bouncing itself up and down. Like, it's, like... <laughs> Like, stop! <laughs> like, you're trying to, like, put your hands under the <laughs> electrode so it'll stop, like, smashing itself against the fucking cold marble that the fucking <laughs> stage is made out of. Then it breaks your fingers, and then it kind of reels back in terror. Like, it has that moment, like, it realizes, oh my god, what have I done? And then and it's then gonna it self-destruct just... <laughs> while you're, like, right in front of it. And that's how the tragedy at fucking Sabrina's gym happens. <laughs> okay. Um, you think I can kill this thing with a headbutt? Probably. Let's go for it. I don't get asked that enough. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anybody does. Come on! Come on. I believe in you. Come on! Yeah! You're a middle! What the fuck is happening, headbutt? <laughs> okay. I don't know if this thing has teeth, but... <laughs> oh, Hypno? Nah, the tentacruel. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, that's not gonna work this time. Okay. That's all right. This is gonna be a pain in the ass, actually. Come on, break out of the confusion real quick. Ah, shit. It's okay. It shouldn't hurt you, right? It will. Wait, I thought Nightshade was a ghost attack. It is. I don't understand what's happening anymore. Fucking damn it. They say psychic doesn't do damage to ghosts, right? So. The, uh. Wait, did they say that? I forget which one it was, but it was broken from what we thought. No, no, Psychic definitely hurts them in this one, because remember earlier we were fighting Alakazam, you were fighting Gengar with your Alakazam, and you Psybeamed and it did super effective. Hmm. Well, then what was the, the correction we made in the last episode, possibly earlier in this episode? I don't that remember Ghost what we does not hit, um, Psychic type. Okay, so Nightshade isn't a ghost attack? Nightshade is like Seismic Toss, where it always does the level amount of damage. Like, it always does 50 damage because this is level 50. That's stupid. It still shouldn't hit me. Yeah, that doesn't... I feel. Stay asleep, stay asleep, stay asleep. Fuck! <sighs> nice. God damn it! It's going wrong. This game is fucking broken. Do you have any more Pokemon? This is your last this one, This is right? my last one. This is his last one. God He's damn it! probably about to murder you. This is bullshit! I got robbed! Motherfucker! Ugh! Asshole! Well, fuck. Goddamn bullshit ass, fucking Robin ass, fucking lucky ass, fucking Morty looking piece of shit! <laughs> that wasn't even the gym leader. No, it wasn't! I got robbed! Damn it! Fuck my anus! Do it right now. Bend me over. Bend me over the foot tray. All right. And unzip. I mean, I'm gonna go get a drink first. <laughs> <laughs> well, duh. When I come back, I am fucking that butt. <laughs> okay. 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 Hypno, I love you. I gave you a try, but you're benched. 
Yeah, there's too much that needs to go right for it's him to be just effective. because of the fucking hypnosis thing. Like, if he didn't just rely on hypnosis, I'd be like, whatever. Mr. Mime, you're back in. <laughs> Yay! Get in here. Let's do it. Oh, Jesus! Does Mr. Mime say Mr. Mime for his name? Yeah, I think I think he's like, Mr. Mime. That sounds about... Mr. Mime. I can see that. Mime. It's always extra creepy to me that... Um... Hold on. Nope. Like, just... There we go. It's always really creepy to me that in in the anime, in the anime, um... <laughs> Is it weird that I don't consider it an anime? <laughs> oh, the cartoon? Yeah. Yes? Because it was on, like, Saturday Morning Kids, like, Fox, WB, whatever the fuck, and, like, that was the only anime that was on there, so to me, it was just a Saturday morning cartoon, you know? Pretty much. Yeah. I can see why. I mean, I think technically it is an anime, Oh, it's but absolutely an anime. I mean, I can see why you don't subconsciously consider it to be an anime. Like, because it existed before I even knew that anime was its own category of thing, you know? <laughs> anyway, it's creepy to me that in the anime, Ash's mom always had, or had, like, a Mr. Mime. It was just her and the Mr. Mime. I bet that thing can diddle like a motherfucker. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at them big, needy fingers. <laughs> <laughs> like, the only way it could have been worse is if it was, like, a lick a tongue. Hmm. That I probably been. didn't want to push it too far. <laughs> Did you know there was an episode of the Pokemon anime that they weren't allowed to air in the United States where, uh... Like At least was... a couple, right? Well, there was one where they had, like, a gun. Yeah. They weren't allowed to air that. And then I think there's one where, like, I don't know if this was banned, but there was one where Jesse dressed up as a girl and had, like, huge fake boobs. Mm -hmm. I d or not Jesse. What's the other one? James. Dressed up like a girl and had huge fake boobs. I don't know if they had to ban that one or not, but I do remember that being pretty fucking weird. <laughs> Man, I should just use Mr. Mime like, every time. <laughs> I know, he's the best! <laughs> but, like, they gave Mr. Mime the only good psychic move so that everybody has to use Mr. Mime! I'm gonna get Mr. Mime's face tattooed above YOLO. I'm surprised you don't crotch. have that already, honestly. What, a Mr. Mime tattoo? You absolutely should. Maybe. I'll I'm almost, like, really disappointed in you that you don't have one already. I don't know that I want a Pokemon tattoo. Why not? I don't know, man, I'm not that into it. Seem pretty into it. I mean, it's cool and all. It's fun. I enjoy the games that I've played, but I'm not like into it. Into it. I've only finished two of the games. Period. It's more than my little brother. And I've only played four of them. My little brother used to play them with me, but I don't think he ever beat one. You know what? Six, because now I played Stadium and Pokemon Snap. Thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> the two best ones. Oh yeah. Well, this game's this game's whatever. This game's fine for its gin. There are a lot of... Uh, wow, that looks so cool. <laughs> there are a lot of uh, gameplay issues with this game. Obviously. <laughs> yeah. Just the whole wake-up thing, like, alone well, is I don't too know much why they would change the basic rules to the game. Like, See, the thing is, I don't 100% remember how it worked at Gen 1. Fair enough. I don't 100% remember. That's fair. Yeah, it's been a long time. Talar is a good name. Yeah, what's uh, the pattern here? Yeah, I don't know what the pattern is. Like, there's a lot of... Like, nine Tails... There's not even an R in Nine Tails. Oh, uh oh, I got it. He just adds lore in there. Okay. Yeah. Dash lore. But where's he getting the, the the first part from? Like that's Rapid Dash, and then the other one was Nine Tails, but it didn't. It, it wasn't Tail R. It was Tail. Er, it was Talar. Talar, but there wasn't an I. No, there wasn't an I. I mean, if they're There's doing no it the I same way they did Rapid Dash, then it would be Tail. T A I L. Then I think they spelled. Well, okay, it's at the very end of the name, yeah. So that one took like the middle. Isn't letters it spelled out. Nine Tails like Tails is in like a story? I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. I don't know. See, and that one's the first part of the name. They're just taking some part of the name and slapping it on there. Pony War. <laughs> Did you know it'd be awesome if there were like. Larva sized ponies. Like these really tiny ones? Yeah, just little tiny horses. That'd be weird. I'd like it. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I would be I would be much more comfortable with it. 
Because real horses creep me the fuck out, dude. Real horses creep you out. Oh, God, yes. Why? They're too calm. <laughs> Man. They're too... You've been around some pretty chill horses. Well, I mean, you, whenever you look at a horse, they're always just, like, hanging out in a field, like, eating grass, you Did know? Did all their like... names end in lore because his name's Burglar? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> More about how horses creep me out next time. Yeah. Thank you for watching, everybody. We'll get to that. <laughs> Burglar. <laughs>